records, you can break it always. Yes, I have this record now, I think around 30 years. The record, my first record was with 104 games. Franz Beckenbauer had in this time 103. And from this uh, day, I, am the, I have this record with uh, on the end 150. Manuel Neuer has 120, I think, something around. Thomas Müller has something around 120. But when, uh, when somebody's breaking the record, I will be the first to congratulate him because uh, <laughs> yeah, 30 years this record, I'm proud of this shirt, but uh, somebody will break it. <laughs> yeah. And uh, yes, and uh, I think Thomas Müller is out from the competition for the national team. Manuel Neuer is uh, very close. He will come back and I wish he come back because he's one of the best goalkeepers still in the world. Maybe the best, I don't know. And uh, sure, he has a chance when he's playing the next three years on the highest level and without injuries, what he has now, he can make uh, sure 150 games in more. A big surprise uh, was changing the coach in this moment because uh, he has, uh, he make a good job. He won last year the German title. Sure, the Champions League result was not so great. This year in the Champions League with Julian Nagelsmann, they won eight games. They won against Barcelona twice, against Inter twice, against Paris Saint-Germain twice. This means uh, perfect, perfect results in the international competition. Sure, in the Bundesliga was uh, not perfect, but uh, sure, they was not away from the from the from the trophy and in the cup too. And for this uh, was. Uh, uh, I was thinking it's a joke message. It's the 1st of April in Germany. 1st of April you make jokes. Mm -hmm. yes? And uh, I was thinking in newspaper make a joke, but I was changing the date. It was not 1st of April. And yes, and uh, yes, this uh, was a decision from the club. Um, maybe there was something behind what we don't know. Maybe. But this was not the dressing room, how they explain. The dressing room means the players. The players was not everybody is behind the coach. I think uh, something happened, but uh, we really don't know because the uh, results was okay. The players was happy. The fans was not against him. I don't know what, uh, what was the main reason, but uh, some reason was disturbing them. Maybe they didn't believe him anymore because uh, something but uh, what we don't know I don't I really don't know but then was some, maybe some problem with the goalkeeper with Manuel Neuer because of the goalkeeper coach in it small small reason maybe make uh, Bayern Munich afraid and make them nervous mm. and decide for Tuchel I think especially in Africa and in Asia you know, the football has not the history like in South America and in Europe and uh, maybe they don't have in the youth team, the, the, in the academies, the coaches who has more experience. And I think for this, uh, it's need a little bit time to come here to Europe, to, especially when you come to a big club, to improve uh, the, 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 the main things in the football. And uh, football is a team sport. And I remember 20, 30 years ago, when the players, the first player come from Africa, like Semi Kufu, my friend from Ghana, he, he was playing more for himself. They didn't understand, we have to work together. Yeah? No, I have to score. No, you don't have to score, we have to win. He was talented, was fast, was strong, good technique, uh, good fights, good mentality, but uh, they work together. This uh, they have to, had, had to improve. And uh, I think uh, uh, many countries, in, uh, for example in Africa, was uh, improving and profited from their player who they played in Europe because in Europe they played in the in the highest uh, level competition England Germany Italy Spain everywhere and with this experience they come back to their national team.